Welcome to this video. In this one, I'm going to talk about this amazing transition pack offered by our visual.store. They have this amazing transition pack for DaVinci Resolve, which I'm going to be showing you in this video. So if you go over to their website, over here, our visual.store, you will find this ultimate pack. You can click over here and you can just go ahead and get this from here. Now this has 100 transitions and 100 sound effects. And there are a lot of things that you can do, a lot of customizations that you can do, which I'm going to be showing you in this video. So since I already have this installed, over here in my downloads, I have this ultimate pack as a zip folder. Then if once you download this, you can simply just right click and extract it. And this will be the folder that you will get. Now double click over here and there will be another zip folder. You can just undo, the, unzip it and then go over to this folder and finally this will be the final folder in which you will find this file which will be a davinci resolve template bundle file so only simply just double click on this and this will open up davinci resolve and it will show you an option to install just click on install and this will be imported in davinci resolve now over here in their website if you go over to guide you will see that they are showing you how to install so this is the pop-up that will appear you can just install and this will then be added to your effects library so over here i have this project opened up and over here we have this video transitions now if you click over here you will see that this is added to this transitions library so if you click over here you will see all of these transitions listed right here so let's go ahead and try something out so I have this footage, the, these two footages, and in between them, I want to add a transition. Let's just go ahead, drag in a transition. And this is very simple. You can just simply hover over it and it will already show you the kind of transition effect that you will get. So let's hover over here and you can see this is the kind of effect that we will get. This is the kind of effect we will get with this invert. So let's just use this color for now and drag this right here between the two clips. Now, of course, you can drag this only on one clip as well, but that's up to you. You want this to be between two clips, that's up to you. You can also, let me just undo this. You can also drag this over at one clip as well. So that's up to you. But right now for this video, I want to, to have this between two clips. So if you play this, this is the kind of effect that we are getting. Now, if you click over here, and this is the transition you can see, this is how long the transition lasts. But you can also drag the slider and increase the duration of this transition. So as you can see, it is increased and you can also decrease this. So I'm just going to undo and this is at default now. So if you click over here, you will be able to see this transition right here. And you can now adjust some settings yourself. So for example, you want to adjust the saturation for this, hue for this, contrast for this. So many different settings that you can change and this is how it is customizable. So let's play this, All right, perfect. Now, if you want to delete an effect, you can just simply right click and then click on delete and it will be gone. Let's try another one. Let's just go with this bounce and play this. So, as you can see, this is how it looks. And once again, if you click over here, you will get the some settings to change. But let me just undo this and let me show you this glitch one, the zoom glitch. So here you can see amazing transition. Now over here, you will see some of these effects have a lot of settings. For example, this glitch one over here, you can change the magenta distortion, shape strength and all of that so amazing stuff and one last thing i want to show you is this text transitions these are very amazing so let's just drag in this one now if you play this this is how you will get so you can see already that it's giving us a lot of options for example we have this text transition between two videos we have these stretch transitions a lot of different transitions 
and we also have zoom transitions as well so with this text one if you click over here you will be able to change the text as well so let's just type in nature and change the font to impact you can also change the font and the font size as well so here you can see it looks perfect you can also change the text color yes you can change the text color so this is great stuff so these are some of the preview you can say i'm just showing you a preview and of course there are many different effects over here but you get the idea okay so one more thing i want to show you is that for example you let's just say that we drag in this text transition play this and this is how it looks but you will see that if you click over here and this is for every single effect over here and this is not just for the text effect this is basically for all of these different effects that if you scroll down you will see is samples over here now what is the samples if you go over to their guide they will tell you about this that what this sample does is it is a slider that adjusts the quality of the motion blur so this is for the motion blur adjustment now by default this is at two and the video that we just saw right now they were at two but they recommend using this between zero and ten although you can take this up to 100 but it's recommended to use between zero and ten so let's just test this let me just click over here and change the sample size to 10. let's see how this looks here you can already see the motion blur but let's keep this at five right there in the middle and this works just perfect so these are some of the tips that you can use and you will find this guide over here in their guide section and one other thing i want to show you is that they are going to be launching a plugin that is called real buddy now with real buddy and i have this installed right here with real buddy what you can do is you can have a guide for your shorts when you are editing shorts tiktok videos instagram reels youtube shorts as well facebook so right now over here i have this short form template set up and there is just a simple video now what i can do is i can simply drag in this plugin and here you can see we have this preview so let me just show you if we full screen this you can see we get this preview of a instagram reel and over here you can see if we uh, sorry this is the tiktok one but you can change this to instagram right here you can change this to facebook right here youtube right here so let's keep this at instagram and of course you can undo this so if you don't want this you can just simply unselect this but right now let's keep this right here then you can change the safe area opacity so this is the safe area in which you want your video to your content to be in basically because this is the safe area that will be shown to the user over here you all you can already see we have this profile coming in this follow and all of the description coming in and then you have this top view over here so it's good to have a guide when you are editing so that you know what exactly the user is going to see and you can also change the opacity of the real body so that's also an option and you can also unselect the real body background so what is this you can already see that if we zoom in you will see this blur over here so if i unselect this this is gone now what this basically is is just a background video you can say that you can increase or decrease so right now if i decrease the frame width you can see the video showing right here is decreasing you can decrease the height as well you can change the corner radius as well and the magenta strength as well and you can also change the background blur size so you can see that the video in the background is visible now so these are some of the settings with this and this is a great plugin if you're editing reels for instagram or you're editing tiktok videos this is an amazing plugin so i just wanted to show you these two things offered by our visual.store they have these two amazing products 
can you can just go over to their website and check it out i will leave a link in the description as well so i hope you will find this useful and i will see you in the next video